Happy Easter, women of Given. This is Sister Michaela, and on behalf of all the St. Cecilia Dominicans, I want you to know of our Easter prayers. I have been thinking of you all, and, and whenever I do, I keep coming back to the story of, of Mary Magdalene, waiting outside the tomb looking for the Lord. And I keep thinking that as, as women, our, our love is drawing us close. And I think in this time right now, that desire to encounter the Lord in a, in a real way in the sacraments is probably just an ache in our hearts. And I, I want you to know that in that, that we're all united and that I'm praying for you. I think that when Mary Magdalene was there, she was looking for the Lord in a certain way. And what happened was he came to her in another. And I think that that is what the Lord wants to do for all of us this Easter, that we draw close to the Lord as best we can. And then in the silence, we listen for our names. So I encourage you, listen for the Lord in prayer. And when he calls your name, I, I think you'll turn and you'll find him. And maybe you won't even recognize him at first. The Lord comes to us in, in new ways all the time. But, but as we gaze on him, we'll come to recognize him and we'll be able to encounter him in a new way. I love the next part of the story too, because then the Lord sends Mary Magdalene off to preach the gospel. And so that is my other bit of encouragement to you, is don't let all of this stop you from preaching. Um, there are always people in need of the gospel, and the first thing we can do is go out to them in prayer. Um, and then maybe just pick up the phone, just being present to those whom the Lord gives you especially as in Mary Magdalene's case to the apostles. What an incredible opportunity we have right now to pray for our priest. We are aching for the mass and, and our priests are aching for us to be able to give us the Lord. So let's be united in, in our prayers for each other, our prayers for our loved ones, and also our prayers for the priests. So know of my love for each of you, my prayers, and a very happy Easter.